Speaking of uh, uh, album Bora ya Mwaka, mmoja yeah. kati ya watu ambao pia wamehusika kwa asilimia kubwa sana ku produce ile album ni pamoja na Yogo. Yogo aliwahi kutangaza kwamba hataki kujihusisha tena na muziki. Labda pengine kupitia hii unamwambia nini Yogo? No, I mean, I mean nitamwambia nini sasa? It's like unajua kuna vitu vina frustrate when you are a good artist, alafu uone matunda kwa ukubwa ambao wewe unadhani upo. Unaacha, unaona au unakuwa frustrated unatoa statement ambazo zinaashiria kama huyu mtu amedata au nini? Ashim mdogo mwenda wazimu is one of the best lyricist Tanzania tumai kwa naye. Hafanyi mziki. Kila msanii lyricist muuliza nikimbishi, muuliza Roma, muuliza nani wote ambao wanajua mistari, watakwambia Ashim noma. Lakini Ashim hafanyi mziki na aliacha kabla hata kujulikana na kila mtu, si ndio? Sababu sometimes unaangalia huko mimi naweka ufundi wote huu nafanya hii na input yangu ni hii najitoa kiasi hiki lakini matokeo kisoda wakati wewe umeweka msuli tembo umeelewa kwa hiyo sometimes ina distract ina boa ina yani ina frustrate na sisi tumeingia tumeinvest na tumejitoa kabisa yani mtu unaacha maelimu uliyosomea unaacha si kazi za familia sometimes unaanza kusema vibaya unapoteza wapenzi yani una vitu kibao vinatokea na huu mziki mwanangu alafu mwisho wa siku bado vitu haviende lakini wewe passion ndio unakusukuma unaendelea kufanya so ina ina frustrate sana na watu wengi wengi sana wamekata tamaa wameachi wameshenje yani but kuna wengine wameendelea kuwa wabishi mpaka sasa hizi so inafurahisha na najua yeye mwenyewe amefurahi kwamba albamu yake ambayo ameiproduce amesimamia kama the head executive producer inachukua inachukua album of the year nyimbo zake zinakuwa utunzi bora best composed na yeye ni part of the composer so it's like it's a great thing you know, it's a very good thing na itamu encourage pengine asikate tamaa ambayo alikuwa anaelekea kuikata au tayari kuisha ikata okay so simple and clear uh, uh, kwenye tuzo ya heshima aliyechukua diamond platinum ana deserve au ha deserve ah sasa mimi sijui wala umetumia vigezo gani vya kusema nani ana deserve au nani ana deserve alafu there are a lot of people who deserve the heshima pengine kuna watu ambao itakiwa wapewe tuzo ya heshima kabla yake lakini mimi sikumbuki hizi award kabla azia aziaondoka nani nani alikuwa tayari shapewa yani kuna Hamza Kalala kuna kina Salumu Abdalla wa Tukiba Marimba kina TX Moshi kina Remy Ongala si ndio bwana tunao kina Lady JD kuna watu wengi kina AY sababu katika modern era AY is one of the artists ambao me commercialize muziki kabla ya Diamond Harmonize na the likes of Vanessa Mde na ERA so it's like kama au tayari kwa shapewa tuzo zao why not diamond has done a lot pia amefanya mambo mengi amefungua milango mingi katoletea waga naambia watu mimi na wasanii wengi wa kongwe ambao nawakubali na nawashimu na wanaweka juu ya diamond lakini wote haja haja achieve achaweza kufanya yeye kwamba ajajitoa yeye tu ametutolea watu wengine katotolea monize katotolea rayvani mboso maromboso alikuwa yule anaitwa lakini sasa hivi mboso lava lava zuchu is the biggest artist in tanzania right now and arguably he her numbers kabla diamond hajatoa hii four numbers za zuchu zikuwa ziko juu ya diamond unaona so then this is mathematics you know numbers don't lie so hivi vitu vyote vilikuwa vinaashiria hivyo so ametuletea wote bila yeye kusimama na kujitoa sometimes ili wasanii wake waende uh, tusinge wapata wasanii katika level hiyo iliyopo so ana style za heshima lakini um, kuna wengine wangeza kupewa kwanza kama kwa hiyo nataka kuwa realistic sababu kuna watu yeye mwenyewe amewakuta kwenye game lakini sasa mimi sina historia kamili ya nani nyuma ameshapewa tuzo ya heshima unaona kabla ya sema kwamba yeye muda wake umefika kupewa sababu he is still doing music na bado mambo mengi anaendelea kuyafanya pengine mtampa mara mbili sababu kuna mambo diamond haja achieve anaweza kaya achieve anytime now his his ep is doing well he's about to drop another album si ndio bwana is touring he just signed with wona kwa hiyo inawezekana kuna vitu vingi kavifanya mtampa mara mbili unaona wakati kuna watu kama nilivyosema kina Saluma Abdalla kina Hamza Kalala si kina nani wako wengi kina John Kitimeke wako wengi ambao pengine tungewapa hizo heshima pia na yeye na ina style so mimi siwezi kum, kumfault sio kosa lake kama wao wameona ni mda wake wa kumpa ni sawa unaona sababu hata wale wengine waliopewa mimi nimeona ni sawa pia okay sawa so, uh, tuzo za KTME inazungumza Kilimanjaro Music Awards miaka iliyopita uh, tulikuwa tunawatamani tuko kipindi hili kwa tunaona wasanii kama kina professor J uh, today leo ni Tanzania Music Awards labda pengine kutokuwepo kwa professor J kwa siku ya leo kuna namna labda unaweza katoa comment yako kuhusiana ile by the way tunajua ni mgonjwa so far uh, utasemaje professor J hajakuwepo ameshinda tuzo siku mbili yupo you don't have to be in flesh kwa wewe kuwepo he is here you can nominate 
Kamendela Kwepo, that's longevity. Dormana is one of the, the greatest of all time when it comes to rappers. Pesaje yupo. Ameshikwa tuzo. Utasemaje ayupo ane kutokwepo pesaje. Ayupo kimwili tu lakini but why should we single out him? Kuna watu wengapi ambao hapo kimwili? Alikiba mwenye kachukua tuzo ayupo kimwili. Kwa nini tumuongee tu Professor J? That's not right. Professor J is here amechukua tuzo na ameendelea kufanya mziki consistency even though ameshafikia level ya ukubwa kabisa. Tumemuona Taita ametoa mziki Sugu, Professor J na Sugu wamekuwa hadi wabunge lakini wameendelea kwa kuonyesha passion yao mziki na wameendelea kutoa mziki they are committed. So it's kind of like they are here. We salute them and those are the greatest of all time. Two of them Sugu na Professor J wako juu pale ndio mara nyingine wanafuata. Kwa hiyo it's like they have been here, they are here. Na leo sugu alikuwepo hapa kuna nani kuna tuzo pia professor sabwe ya ki emaradhi ndio maana yupo so they are here physically if not physically then then uh, spiritually you can assist it ni tunafanya furaha kurudi na saa inazidi yale malalamiko tunayonayo sasa hizi hadi tuenjoy tu mimi ndio tutatoa sasa tunaona baadhi ya viongozi wakubwa hapa kwa stage
kuja sisi kutoa nafsi ya kutaka mimi tuweke muziki mbele alafu muziki utatumia tuweke muziki mbele muziki utakuja ukakurudisha wewe kwa sababu tuweke muziki mbele bado pale pale juu ilipokuwa hapo unasemaga ukijishusha ndio unakwezwa si ndio eh so hicho ndio cha msingi kuliko vyote Carry my story live Bonyeza hapa ku subscribe na bonyeza hapa kwenye alama ya kengele ili usipitwe na video mpya kila inapowekwa